Hello everyone, I am Amit, a computer science educator from India and in our remote learning series today we are going to learn how to share resources to engage students using amazing platform called Wacklet. Let's start doing it. So first of all, we'll sign in into our Wacklet account by typing wacklet.com into the browser. If you are already signed in, so it will open your account or else you have to sign in. So it's time to click the create new collection button. I have clicked that. Now it's time to add a cover image of uh, my collection. So I can choose any, say this may become my image as I want to teach about network security concept, uh, concepts in computer science. So I have uh, selected the relevant image. So I think it's done. It's time to save it. It depends upon the speed of your internet connection that uh, how you're gonna upload and also the size of the image. Now, network security concepts. Uh, this collection contains uh, notes video tutorials, uh, quizzes, whatever you want, assignments and uh, reference material related to network security concepts. It depends upon you that how uh, what kind of description you may write. Now it comes to adding the resources. Let's hit the plus button. So in the plus button I would like to add some outline of my collection. So I would like like basics of network security maybe like this. First of all I'll go with this topic. If I want to keep it heading size I can do that. I can add a list like uh, First of all, I would like to sh share notes with them. I would like to share some video tutorial with them. Then uh, a quiz maybe, an assignment maybe, a uh, reference uh, material. It may be in the form of audio, video or textual material. Let's let it be done. Now it's an outline according to which I'll be doing this. So it will be easy for the students to understand also. Now I'll hit the plus button to add, I'll add the resources. First of all, notes. So I'll go with the PDF. So here is my PDF ready on network security concepts. Your resources must be ready in order to uh, share quickly uh, onto the platform. One more thing that it depends upon your internet speed, uh, speed as well as the size of your uh, resource whatever you want to share with your uh, students. Uh, I think I've selected quite uh, bigger ones, so it is taking that much of time. But it depends on the resources you want to share. It will be appearing here. Uh, meanwhile, it is being uploaded. I'll add another resource, that is a video tutorial. So here I can paste the URL of uh, any video tutorial I have already created. So I have my YouTube channel here where I uh, have some tutorials ready. So on network security concept do I have one? Yes, I have one tutorial ready. So l let me take its URL from here and I took this URL and I'll paste it here. So it will be done. So this will be a direct link to my video tutorial. Now it's time to go to quiz. So I've already created a quiz on network security concept in Google Forms. So I'll just take its sharing link, shortened one, copy the link, come back to my Wacklet collection, paste it there. So this quiz has also been added to my collection. Now it's time to add some assignment related to topic. Do I have an assignment? Yes, I have in the form of PDF. 
I can add that. Okay, assignment. This is my assignment. The assignment is done. It again depends upon the size of your file and speed of the internet that how much time will it take to get uploaded. So I have already added uh, this uh, mm, notes as well as uh, video link to my video tutorial, a quiz on the topic as well as assignment. Now it's turn to add reference material. So reference material can directly be curated from YouTube also if you want or you can upload anything like network security concepts. So though I have uh, curated some uh, good material, I have already, this is a direct link to your, this thing, uh, YouTube. Here you can get, say, I find this one useful for my students. So I'll include this. Okay. I'll just select it, add it. So this will be added as the resource material or the reference material for my students to know about the topic. Now I'll uh, change the layout of this uh, as a compact view in order to see all the resources easily. These are all resources added and I'll hit the save button. Uh, it's content is automatically saved though. I'll hit the done button to complete this resource sharing thing. So here is my wonderful collection ready on a particular topic which is the simplest way to share resources or even course material with the student through a very simple link. So for that what I have to done first of all I have to edit my collection, change the mode of my collection as public then I can share it with my student also as now the share button is visible uh, I'll get the URL I got it I can share it through social media also or just copy this link and this link can be shared with the student here you can see this collection is ready thank you so much